Hi, my name is Ryan with Best Kiteboarding, and today I'm going to show you how to install the all new 2014 Mercury Patent Strap. The 2014 Mercury Patent Strap system comes with two footbeds, your two foot straps, your grab handle, your bag of hardware, and then your twin tip board manual. So the only tool we're going to need for today's installation is a Phillips head screwdriver. I'm going to be building out this board as if it were facing you. So everything's going to be backwards for me, but you'll see it just as if you were building it out yourself. I like to first start off by laying out all my parts and pieces on the board so I know where everything goes. I'll take my pads and straps and lay them over the inserts using the big toe as the guideline for being in the center of the board. Next, I'll grab my straps and lay them over my pads. I can always associate which pad goes with which strap because I want my Velcro to open towards the inside of the board. Lastly, we've got our grab handle. First step in the process is to attach the actual pad itself to the foot strap. We wanna get it lined up right over these three notches here and here so that each notch corresponds. And you're gonna to wanna to get that first one to sink right into that hole like that. Then go ahead and roll it backwards, getting the second notch to fit into place. And then lastly, the third. The other side of the foot pad, you'll see now we've got our black notches starting to pop out the bottom. So go ahead and hold the, uh, the bottom of the pad with one hand and push it all the way through with the rest. And what we're gonna wanna do is move this forward and then pull up. And it, when we pull up, it will lock those notches into place underneath the foot pad. Once we've got one side done, we're gonna wanna flip it around and do the same thing to the other side. Thing again, we're gonna wanna start with the first one. I found it best to start at a 45 degree angle, pushing it in and then rolling it back to get the second and then lastly, the third. We've got our foot pads sticking through the bottom of our foot strap and they're both slid all the way as far forward as possible. And then once you've got them down nice and tight, go ahead and pull up to make sure that you've got them locked into place on one side and then the other. The strap is held down to the pad by an elastic cushion. This ensures that you're always gonna get that nice tight fit. To install the Velcro, simply open up the Velcro. Go ahead and go underneath. Feed it out through one eyelet folding it back over and onto the center Velcro again. Same thing with the second one. Now that we got one of our Mercury pads and straps built out, it's time to build out the second one and get these guys mounted onto the board. So with the hardware, you're gonna have four sets of washers. These are gonna go with each pad and strap. Then you're gonna find they've got some longer screws and some shorter screws. These four longer screws are gonna go with the pads and straps. These two shorter screws are gonna go with your new best grab handle. So let's start by mounting that one first. To mount the grab handle, simply stick the screw right through, find the hole that you want to mount it on, place it right over it. You can even use your fingers to help get it started. So we've got that one set, place it right through. Once you've got your screw set inside those insert holes, go ahead and take your screwdriver and using a little bit of force, go ahead and screw them all the way down until they're finger tight once. Side number two, finger tight. And then I like to go back and try and do one more quarter turn. Our grab handle's on there and we're good to go. One thing you might notice is that we've got this arrow, this notch on each one of our washers. You want that to be pointing towards the outside of the pad and strap. You're gonna wanna go ahead and take your screwdriver and your screw and washer and line them up. So I'm gonna go ahead and drop the washer and the screw right over that hole. Just give a nice soft turn to get it started. Once I can feel it starting to get tight and the washer not shaking anymore, before I tighten it all the way down, I wanna start and get the inner one. Here's my washer, here's the arrow. Once I can't tighten it down anymore, I know that this pads and strap is set. Now that we've got our new 2014 Mercury pads and straps built out, and we've got all four fins connected to the board, we're almost ready to hit the water. Last thing we recommend is that you size the foot pads and straps on land before you actually get on the water. If you have any additional questions, feel free to find out more information by contacting your local Best Retailer or going on bestkiteboarding.com.